Benvenuti sulla sentiero degli dei. Welcome to the path of the gods. It's days like today that inspire me. They make me so happy that we decided to travel. Good morning, everybody. We are waking up from our Airbnb in Sorrento and just gonna take in one more time the view from our Airbnb. And look at this fresh morning sun, everybody. Ah, oh, it feels so much warmer than it is. Still pretty damn beautiful. So we're taking it in, gonna get some coffee and then get going east on the Amalfi Coast. Gonna start some hiking at Path of the Gods Trail. Sounds absolutely epic. We're gonna check out some Positano and then make our way back to Naples. Goodbye, Airbnb. Buongiorno everybody, we are in Balmirano. It's a windy bus ride, definitely not for the faint of heart, especially if you have motion sickness. Here's a little view of the town, nice little church, little plaza. The reason we came to Balmirano is to hike the famous Path of the Gods, which is a beautiful trail going across the coastline of the Amalfi Coast, which is one of the most sought after destinations of all Italy, Europe, the world, whatever may have you, it's awesome. And it's one of the main reasons we decided to come to Italy to do this hike and see the beautiful Amalfi Coast. And we're gonna end our trip in the famous town of Positano, which has the beautiful pastel buildings that look like they're tumbling down the cliffside into the water. So we're gonna begin the hike now. It's about 11.30, about the warmest it's gonna get today. It's about high 40s, almost 50 degrees, but it's really sunny, clear skies, so the views should be amazing. So let's go and adventure, guys. It's Path of the Gods. Bomerano in the background. Benvenuti sul sentiero degli dei. Welcome to the Path of the Gods. And that water is stunning, guys. So it looks like we officially just started the trail from the Laxus Point, and the views are already astounding. Views of the ocean, the dramatic cliffs in the background. I'm just dumbfounded, guys. And the weather is perfect. It feels like it's 60 degrees. While the hiking and the sun like this, the views will be absolutely perfect. I'm so excited. I'm gonna keep on recording as we go, guys. Let's show you the views along the way. Just can't believe it. Hope it's in focus. Look at everybody. Little hillsides where it looks like they grow different crops. Another really cool feature of this hike is there's lots of little abandoned stone and brick buildings along the way. And I wonder what their function was back in the day. Maybe they were somewhere to worship. Maybe there's someone's house. Maybe an old farm owner. I don't know. It'd be really cool to know the history. So we just finished a little uphill section. Most of it has been uh, downhill from Balmerano to Nocele. It's very rocky, the Mediterranean rocky kind of coast. Reminds me of the Rocky Mountains in Colorado. But of course, Never had water like this in Colorado. It was pretty landlocked. Positano, Claiano, Rocelli. Guys, this trail is taking us to the next level of sights and experiences. I cannot believe it. <laughs> I'm about to trip because I can't stop staring. Alright everybody, so we are at a beautiful little stopping point along Path of the Gods. And I know you want to move it here, because the views are absolutely insane. Let's get going guys, Path of the Gods. Oh here Vanessa, it's time for dinner. They're ringing the bell. Oh my god. It's time for his dinner. So it looks like we're getting our first sight of Positano along the coast, guys, which means it's the end in sight, but I hope it doesn't end soon because I'm loving this so much. Keep on going, guys. Pretty little shaded section. Back uphill. <laughs> Vanessa, you're ruining the shot. Oh, it's okay. Cut her some slack, Wanders.
Guys, it's days like today that inspire me. They make me so happy that we decided to travel and just go out there, try and make it happen, even if we don't have the most income, even if we have to try and force our life to revolve around this. It's so worth it because we'll look back at this for years and decades, me and Vanessa, and hopefully you guys, because uh, it'll be logged on YouTube. So maybe when I'm an old man, I could see myself being young with already developing knee problems doing hikes like these. Either way, it's so inspiring. It makes me feel like I just need to just sit in a room with my eyes closed and just go over every thought and feeling and sight that I experienced and really take it in. That water, absolutely ridiculously clear. You can see the bottom all the way up from this hiking trail on the mountain. So now that we made it around this turn, it's a bit more exposed, everybody, but we are greeted by the views of the famous Positano, probably one of the most photographed places in all of Italy. And that's where we're gonna end up today's hike. Off the coast, Praiano, the hills and fields, the massive white rocks, abandoned building, what else can you ask for? All right, everybody, it's snack time on this random little stop we found on the coast. And here's our snack. It's a big ass thing of some sort of seasoned bread that we bought at some uh, bakery with some views that are impossible to beat. Palitano, rest of the Amalfi Coast. So excited. I just love the mist covering the end of the Amalfi Coast and Capri in the background. Nice little rock stacked tower garden, guys. Is it worth your time for a detour? Definitely. This is the only reason I did the hike. No, don't waste your time unless you just want to see a bunch of stacked rocks. Kind of cool, but. I'm tired. <laughs> no chele. We did it.